Xenophage has been the only bug-centric exotic for far too long. Luckily, Witch Queen has brought us the Amazing Worm Gun, also known as Parasite. Wonder what it would look like as a hand cannon or a shotgun? Let's find out. Here's Parasite as a hand cannon. I was actually really scared of making weapons out of Parasite, since it's a heavy grenade launcher. That means you can't see the back grip. Luckily though, this front grip works perfectly. I love everything about this. You can see that I've used the original weapon cylinder as the hand cannon cylinder here. Let's check out that firing animation. You can see that it is actually shooting hive worms. I mentioned Xenophage at the beginning of this video. Let's see Parasite as a machine gun. Well, it's definitely got a Xenophage thing going on. One of the most important ways that I portray scale here is by making the sight very small relative to the rest of the weapon. It's kind of a reference point, since you generally know how large the sight is. I gave it that super slow Xenophage fire rate too. Check it out. How about we turn Parasite into a grenade launcher? No, like a breach grenade launcher. You can see I've duplicated and straightened out the back grip for that vertical front handle. I also stretched the side up to look more like a grenade launcher sight. Here it is shooting. Hey, I almost forgot to do a shotgun. Well, here it is. This shotgun looks like it would take heavy ammo, and maybe some of your super bar too. I used the cylinder as a kind of a joining piece between the two halves of the barrel, and this piece of the metal down here is the pump. You'll see it moving in the animation. Let's check that out. And let me just say, the idea of an explosive payload's precision slug shotgun sounds like way too much fun. And last but not least, Parasite as a rocket launcher. I used that same vertical handle grip from the breech grenade launcher here, and I've done something similar with the cylinder as I did with the shotgun. But instead of just joining the two barrel halves, it separates the barrel from the reloadable tube. And you can see I put a sight over here, which makes it easier to aim the Zoll-sized worms. Let's see the animation. I'm going to try and upload Witch Queen custom weapon videos every day this week. So which weapon do you want me to cover next? Let me know in the comments. Thanks. Take care.